So if you're still going outside and going to bars and clubs, bitch, you dumb. Video on the way to the baddest bitch on the mall. Good morning, how are you guys? Okay, today we're, what are we doing? What do we do? What are we doing today? Today we're doing Marc Jacob, the remarkable full coverage foundation. Marc Jacob is an American fashion designer, currently owned by the LVMH Group. It's a glass bottle. It retails for $56. Let's read about it. Instant full coverage, all day wig less wear. Less is more. Okay. 24 hours full coverage. Uh, ultra lightweighted formula. Oil free formula contains twice as much pigment as the leading full coverage foundation. So you don't really need that much. So so instead of doing five pumps, as I always do, I'm gonna do three pumps today. It's supposed to be a easy blended foundation to effortless blending with a smooth, soft matte finish. All right, let's get into it. I've already prepped my skin with Laura Mercier. We open it up. It's not a pump. It's like this. All right. Uh, it's not really liquidy. Um, let's blend. Okay, it is indeed very pigmented. It feels really lightweight, it's just like the NARS yesterday. It feels like it's like you're blending a powder. Not sure if it's gonna be too dry, but for my face today, I'll use a uh, powder proof plus Chanel powder. I could practically call this perfect right now, flawless. And I'll see you guys back home. <laughs> All right, welcome back guys. Uh, let's jump right into the details. All right, we always start with under eyes. Man, you wouldn't expect this one to be like that moisturizing, but um, I would say the under eye is doing okay. It's not like dry, but you can tell like it is like a matte finish. Well, the nose is probably the worst part of the whole complexion. It's kind of like gone and kind of a dry patchy going on here. Problem about the forehead is probably um, it's either really oily or dry. You see that top and bottom, it just not balanced it out. Uh, coverage is still there, but it just um, it's the it's a bit too dry on the side. And the rest of the face is like doing okay. Coverage is still there, but overall a bit dry. Good thing is like very full coverage. Um, great matte foundation. I think it would be very good for oily skin. But you know, sometimes you don't expect moisturization from a matte foundation, but it's a little bit dry. Like, it's not a huge issue, but it's just not that moisturized. It feels like my skin has been pulled off like a little bit. Make sure you prep your skin into a very ideal moisturized level. It's like a, a difficult time to talk about makeup every day and try to pretend like nothing happened. Everything is happening so fast and so serious. I, I just need a little bit of distraction from uh, the part of the real world. And by recording a video and share it to the rest of the world, is just my saving grace. For that, I want to thank you so much for all the likes, all the comments, and I hope my video helped you in a certain type of way. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new one.